Hope you got that vault's location. I eavesdropped on Skavik and some mercenaries over an encrypted comm channel. They're trying to beat us to the vault. Sounds like they're closing in. Beryl says the vault is buried in a place called Zone Zero. Then we're not sunk yet. Unlike us, the mercenaries don't have the vault's exact coordinates. From what I overheard, Skavik's men aren't having much luck in their search for the vault. Something out there is eating those mercenaries alive. Literally. I'd love to be around for that slaughter. You don't actually eat people, do you? On second thought, don't answer that. Get to the vault as fast as you can, then open the lock with this Geonosian slicer module. It took me months to trade for this. Don't lose it, understand? You never heard of having a backup, genius? I have a backup. Your head. I figure it can break open anything. Good luck, partner. Hope I see you again soon. I'll let you know what I dig up. I'll be waiting, Captain. Remember me? Agent Saganti with the Republic Customs Office. I have some questions about Beryl Thorne. What do you want to know, Agent? I suspect Thorne is smuggling relics. And I think I know how she's doing it. What I lack is proof. I need someone to step forward and testify so I can arrest her. I'm looking for an honest citizen, Captain. Beryl's a good person. She's not doing anything wrong. If I catch you covering for her... Well, let's not consider the ugly implications. I'm authorized to pay a generous sum for any lead resulting in an arrest. Think about what's best for you. Are you absolutely sure you don't know anything about Beryl Thorne's criminal activities? Tyridol is the real smuggler, Agent Siganti. Thorne's partner? What do you have to back up that accusation? The crazy Deveronian attacked me at the scavenger base. It was his last mistake. You admit to being with scavengers and killing a man? What makes you think I won't arrest you? Tyridol wasn't the only scavenger I killed. I did you all sorts of favors, Agent. If Tyridol was smuggling relics with those scum, they deserve what they got. Sounds like I might be wrong about Thorn. Unfortunately, I may never be able to verify your story. I'm afraid that means no reward. Just leave poor Beryl alone. She's innocent. Nobody's innocent. If I've learned anything in this job, it's that. You've been very helpful, Captain. Goodbye. Barrel needs to clear out of here. That agent won't give up. I don't want Barrel getting caught. Me neither. She's one of the good guys. We should drop by her place on our way to Zone Zero. It's the least we can do. Didn't expect to see you again. What's the occasion, Captain? Republic Customs is on to you. I kept them off your back. You have the vault's coordinates. You didn't have to come warn me, but you did. Where I come from, the best friends are the ones who lie for you. Guess you're a better friend than I thought. I've always been on your side, Beryl. Been a while since anyone stood up for me. Feels like I'm always on my own. What am I, Mistress Beryl? Spare parts? I down, Argo. The captain knows what I mean, right? You don't have to rush off right away, do you? You bought me a nice head start. Figure I've got time to spare. Argo, start packing. I'd like some privacy. Anything to get off this make a forsaken planet, Mistress Beryl. I'll, uh, just go count the rat ghouls. Been saving a bottle of Cassandran brandy for a special occasion. This seems like one. Come on. I wish we had more time, but I better get going. I want you to have this. Save me more times than I can count. I hope it does the same for you. I'm glad we're parting as friends. Risha doesn't deserve a partner like you. Watch your back, alright? I'll get off Terrace while the getting's good. I know Argo's ready. You have no idea, Mr. Sparrow. Thanks for everything, Captain. What the? Who the? How'd you? You are one ugly pile of scrap, aren't you? How dare? What are you? This is first-rate battle armor! We've been through ten kinds of pain getting to this vault, and not to watch you open it first. Skavik, you there? You want to see this, boss? We're at the vault, but we're not alone. 
<laughs> Too perfect. I love it when everything comes together like this. How's life treating you, Captain? You enjoying my ship and all my stuff? What about that two-faced Risha? Doing great. Thanks. You expect me to believe you melted that Snow Queen? Come on. She's looking for a real man. Still owe you for that mess on Coruscant. You have any idea the grief I'm taking? I could kill everybody who cracks a joke, but uh, that's a lot of work. So why don't you just die already? I'm ready to settle this when you are. Glad to hear you're on board with the plan. Roxer, I want you and the boys to spare no effort killing my friend, and make it as painful as possible. You heard the boss. Fry this fool! You got the astrogation chart, didn't you? I can tell by the look on your face. Did you ever doubt me? If I did, you've just made me a believer for life. That astrogation chart belonged to an exchange gangster named Davik Kang. Davik personally mapped dozens of hyperlanes between the core and outer rim systems. He found shortcuts and hideouts all over the galaxy. How'd you find out about this chart? The same way I find out about everything. Listening to the right people. Have you studied much galactic history, Captain? Interesting patterns emerge if you pay attention. Davit Kang's criminal empire ended when this planet was destroyed. Nock Drayan's empire was born when he destroyed a planet. Nock Drayan destroyed a whole planet? Technically, it was only a single settlement. Once upon a time, there was a pirate haven on the outer rim called Mandelia. Thousands of criminals lived there. One bright morning, Nock Drayan's freighter dropped out of hyperspace over Mandelia. He demanded the pirates surrender to him or die. What did Nock want with the pirates? These pirates were successful pirates. They had acquired a lot of wealth, and Nock decided he wanted it. When the pirates sent their reply, Nock launched a single rocket at their settlement. The warhead was tipped with an Imperial nerve toxin. The entire settlement died in less than a minute. Where did Nock get an Imperial warhead? He stole it, of course. He'd been looking for a way to take down Mandelia in one shot, and that was the perfect solution. That day at Mandelia, Nock Drayan went from being a low-rent smuggler to one of the richest criminals in the galaxy. Anyway, that's how the legend goes. I should probably let you get back to work. How about some more history lessons someplace private? You're incorrigible. Come see me when you're irresistible and we'll talk. At any rate, I'm ready to leave Taris. I'm sure we can find someplace more interesting to be. You've got a bad case of wanderlust, Risha. Hey, it's one of my best qualities. <laughs>